breakfast is you guessed it uh avocado toast and bacon with my zip fizz y'all i think i have lost my voice all right buddies where are we headed today church camp church camp for the whole week but you get to come home in the afternoons not spend the night yet maybe next year all right i thought we were staying no i can never leave you that long no no like um like we're gonna go at night and then come back no you're done at four so let's go so we're not late for the bus Hi guys, we're back with another Koi Cam and today we are going to Ann Merritt, which you can't see his face, or mine. Yeah, but when we get back home, we're gonna tell you all about it. Here comes the bus. Oh my gosh, so much fun. Now I have got to run into the farm store and try to find some stuff. Um, for our horse shows, we use a certain kind of like, oh, they have so many pretty flowers too, y'all. Well, you can't see them. Anyway, we use a certain kind of like show sheen conditioner when we show and like everybody's out online. So I'm freaking out. So I'm gonna see if they have some here. Well, I didn't find what I needed, but now I'm so tempted to go back and get some of these beautiful flowers. They're all on clearance or sale now. Oh my gosh. They're so pretty. Do I need more flowers? No, I don't. Okay, y'all. I have been home for a while now. I've just been getting some laundry going. These are coys I gotta fold. I've been out in the horse trailer trying to get that organized and cleaned out. I got all these shirts that need to be taken back to the cleaners. Most of the shirts that they ride in can um, last a few shows, but the ones they do showmanship at Halter and just get so nasty on the arms from horses rubbing on them and stuff, they gotta be done again. So I'm out of breath. <laughs> um, and I got a bunch of jeans. So I'm gonna see if Craig needs anything too. And then I'm gonna take these to the cleaners um, tomorrow in the big city and then probably do a little shopping. So I think I'll take you along for that fun. But right now, I gotta get actually ready for the day because I didn't have time to put makeup on before I dropped them off at the bus stop. Okay, official hello for today. Um, I just sort of have a little um, simple fishtail braid that didn't go so well and I have like a clip in the back to keep on my hair. It's, I love it layered because it curls better that way. In fact, I'm gonna go in here in a few weeks um, to get it layered again before we go to Vegas. But when you do that, it's hard to like pull your hair all the way over because this hair is so short. Anyway, doesn't matter. This is what we're rocking today. It is not cold outside, but when we were rushing this morning to get the boys to the bus stop for camp, I didn't feel like slathering on sunscreen. So I just put one of my little cooler bar hoodies on and I'm in the house and it's nice and cool in here. So that's fine for now. Although Craig did just call and say, did I want to ride to town with him? He had a few errands to run. I don't know if we'll get lunch or not. We have a ton of stuff to eat because uh, my cousin came last night with her family um, and we grilled and had so much fun and I got a bunch of, well, not a bunch, but a few um, little clips of them here. Um, she has two kids. I think I already said all this, but two kids very close to the boys in age and y'all. They had so much fun. And in fact, she doesn't live very far from my mom and daddy. And so when we're there in August, we're gonna plan to do something and get all together because now my brother, who they get to see quite often more than me, obviously, because I'm up here in Iowa and he lives in New Orleans and she lives, I think it's like 45 minutes from New Orleans. It's not far from New Orleans. Anyway, um, he, my brother has kids, my kids is age too, so we're all gonna get them together. Hopefully when I'm in Mississippi um, and let them see each other again, cause my boys and her girls are already like begging to see <laughs> and begging to hang out again because they had so much fun and they had not seen each other since they were tiny, tiny. Tiny, tiny uh, little kids, little babies. Well, I guess they were bigger than babies, but they were little. Anyway, so I'm gonna show you that now. Hot Mess Express here, y'all. I'm not vlogging today. We just got back from the two-day big horse show weekend. So much fun. Well, yesterday, not so much, but I probably already told you about that in the regular vlog, but it's Sunday night, and my sweet cousin from Louisiana is coming to visit, and we cannot wait. She watches the vlogs. I'm sure she's gonna be watching this one because she's gonna be on it, and her girls, Ellen Sawyer, and her sweet husband, Clay. I have not seen her, I cannot remember. It's been t way too long. She is actually my sister's age, or probably one year younger than my sister, I forget. Um, but she like grew up with us, like she was always at our house. She has always lived in Louisiana, obviously, but not very far, like two hours away. So she would always come, not always, but, but we saw her a ton growing up. And actually her and my sister were obviously closer growing up, but here lately, just as we've become mamas and have kids the same age, we've really gotten close and I'm so, so, so excited to see her. So they're on their way. We are just being super casual. Craig's grilling New York Strip. 
It looks delicious. I've got some pasta salad I made last night when we got home from the show. Just some beans, like a hobo beans, like all kind of mixed beans together with bacon and hamburgers. Super easy that's on the crock pot. We've just got chips and then he's doing burgers. So we've got buns and all that stuff too. And um, watermelons. So we're patiently awaiting their arrival. And the most important part, the Fiesta layout. I just went all of the pretty colors because I had these cute napkins and I thought the girls would think those were fun. So that is all ready to go. And speaking of the girls, I got them some little goodie bags put together for their road trip. Did I tell you why they were coming? They are going out to the Black Hills and kind of across North Dakota and stuff. That's something in the microwave um, on vacation. And so this was kind of sort of on the way. Um, so that's why they're stopping here to see us tonight. But um, I thought this would be fun like to have in the car, just pins and little scrunchies and all sorts of candy from um, a big candy store and chapsticks and um, a little notebook and this y'all I really want one of these for myself <laughs> anyway I just thought this would be just something fun since they're coming to see me and I want them to love me and I have not seen them since they were tiny so they probably don't even know who I am so this is my way of bribing them to love me okay did it work girls let me know <laughs> all right we've got a veggie tray that I just purchased and put on my cute little turquoise hostess um fiesta where it is I don't know if y'all have ever seen that I usually keep it way in the back over there in my hutch I've just got some cut um watermelon ready to go and this is just like a box suddenly salad <laughs> bacon ranch so that is that and then Craig's got the steaks getting ready over here oh don't show them he's having to thaw them in the microwave and he don't like that and then these are the beans that are smelling delicious <laughs> Okay, y'all, she's been in the car all day and I've been in a horse show all day, but this is Catherine. Now, this is my mama's brother's daughter. And you are how much older than me? We won't tell her mm, ages. I'm the same age. Same. She's the same age. Yay. <laughs> okay. And she has two little girls and the boys are playing and they are having so much fun. Okay, that's introductions. Yay. <laughs> Hi, guys. How's it going? Everybody having fun? Yeah. Hi, guys. How's it going over here? You just showing your room? And your unmade bed. Sorry, do you make your bed every morning? <laughs> Y'all know they had to go on a Kubota ride. Right. Woohoo! <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> so much fun. There they go. Oh boy. Checking out the tractors. This is just so riveting. <laughs> you did. Elle's riding Jake again. One time um, when Merritt had his first birthday party in Mississippi and Jake still lived in Mississippi, she rode him. And now they're back to loving each other again. It's like reunited, Elle. <laughs> well, Sawyer's so gonna have her turn. Catler's feeling left out. Y'all, they just left and we just had the best visit. But look <laughs> at this candle that Sawyer, I think it was just Sawyer, maybe Elle picked it out too, but she said, it matches all my new tropical stuff outside and they brought it to me and it smells so good. How stinking sweet was that? Oh my goodness, I wish we lived closer to them. It was so much fun. And look what they brought the boys they had gotten in Idaho on one of their other road trips. <laughs> all of these bigfoot stickers oh my goodness do they know us or what? Oh, that was so much fun as you can see and it's funny i don't know if i got Catherine talking that much but everybody says that i sound like her <laughs> when they like like my mom will talk to me or hear me on something or you know she's like you sound just like Catherine. <laughs> and i'm like i know anyway uh, it was so good to see her and her kids and her husband again so that was fun um and i gotta i've got my candle over here i gotta light that thing it smells so good thanks girls <laughs> anyway um I gotta catch you up on this horse show situation. So, we had a great weekend. Actually, sat Sunday was much better than Saturday. Saturday was a struggle. It rained the entire day. We've never shown in complete rain before. We've done like off and on rain and like rain delays and stuff, but like it literally at least sprinkled or rained all day long. So, we were like hiding in trailers and hiding in stalls and running out and going to different buildings and trying to get it done, but we got it done. It was, it was a lot, y'all. <laughs> 
but we got it done. And then Saturday was just, I mean, Sunday was just beautiful. We had a beautiful sunny day and they, the boys did great sassy grad. That was a double judge, which means there's two judges judging it all every class that they're in. And I think they do 13 classes between the two of them. Um, Sassy got first place in Halter under both judges. And Jake got a first. And and um, Catlow got a first. So that Merritt and McCoy both got a first place with the Little Ponies. And Merritt um, did walk track and got second with Sassy. And he even loped her during warm-up. Um, I don't know. For those of you non-horse show people that still love to follow us along during the horse shows. Um... Merritt does walk trot only with Sassy just because he's just still like getting to know her and training her and you know they're just kind of growing together and so he has not loped her maybe he's loped her a little bit but not much um and loping is like the faster gait obviously and so uh that's what you do when you do pleasure classes and so he only does walk trot with Sassy not pony pleasure with her and so uh they were in the warm-up um which is what they do before the show just to kind of get the horses warmed up and he loped her we're all like freaking out so hopefully we will um in the next few weeks kind of get that fine-tuned and maybe he'll do pony pleasure with her at the next show we'll see we're not pushing anything but he was excited and that was good and he she just did it like it was just great and he looked good on her so that was fun what else happened? Um, they did very good in their um, games. Um, they did barrels and speed dash and all that. So, y'all, I didn't get any. I got a few pictures on my phone, but that was it. I didn't even get my big girl, my nice <laughs> camera out. I call it my big girl camera. I didn't even get it out of the truck. So, I don't have any really good pictures to share. The boys did some fun, like, um, TikToks and like dance and videos with some of their friends. I don't know if uh, you probably can't even put those on here. It's probably like copyrighted anyway, but that was fun. So make sure that you are look at all these clothes, my girl. Oh my gosh. Um, make sure you gotta get those folded. Um, make sure that you're following me on Instagram because like show days like that, like I as a story during the day and like you know was putting stories up, but like uh didn't have time to actually pick the video up. We have a show. I'm rambling, y'all. We have a show in three weeks. It's just a one day show, um, and it's a really good arena and we always have fun there and it's just like a, it's a good show we always it's just I don't know something about some different different shows are better than others anyway I think I woo yeah I got just in my sink um I think I will vlog that one I was kind of thinking ahead to like which show can I vlog because I know y'all want to see them showing and everything so I think I'll like take the camera along and we'll do like a day in the life of showing maybe I'll even do like two days like Friday like how we get ready and pack the trailer and do all that stuff and then Saturday for the show so I plan on doing that <laughs> Anyway, right now, I need to get clothes um, folded and see what Craig wants to do. Um, it feels so weird not having the boys here, y'all. I know they've been, like, doing practice every morning for baseball, but I usually just sit there with them um, and wait for them. So, now I'm, like, home and have all this free time. I've just been washing clothes all morning. So, um, anyway, I'm going to do all that, and then we'll catch back up soon. All right, y'all. I got my candle lit. It is going. I was going to fold clothes, but then I decided I would show you. All my Amazon stuff. This is the rest of the Prime Day stuff. It all came in. Um, I tried this high key cereal. I've never had it before. It is delicious. I don't know that I will repurchase because it's expensive and it's not much in it, but it's so good. <laughs> In fact, if we don't go out for lunch, I might even eat this, even though we got hamburgers and steak in the fridge. Um, it is good. And all the high-key stuff was just like, I don't know, a couple dollars or so off. It wasn't like a crazy deal or anything, but I had been wanting to try some of this stuff, so that worked out. I did get some of the pancake and waffle mix, and I can't for the life of me remember if I have tried this or not. I've tried a lot of different kind of pancake mixes, but I don't think I tried the high-key, so anyway, I just grabbed that so we can have, pan or I can have pancakes um, one morning, and then I had told, oh, that's coming down. I had told y'all that I got the strap or the dress, and I think it's gonna look so cute. I brought my little purse out here, so I will put the strap on and go get the dress and see how it all looks together, but I love this little strap. I don't know. It's not gonna go with that green and pink um, flowered kind of Hawaiian dress. I don't know what I'm gonna do with that one. I love I think it looks so cute with just this but like this I gotta figure out a strap to go with it if I wear that dress I don't know. I'm still contemplating somebody one of you. I think it was you of uh, Jackie said wear that dress girl <laughs> But I don't know. It's so short y'all. Anyway, um, let me take these out there in like a little package All right, this was not a prime deal, but I had just wanted some of these these are actually grapefruit swings But I thought as much as they're into the kiwi 
Um, and we only have one of the little Zespri like knife spoons that I would grab some of these. That way we can just cut the kiwi and they can eat them um, with the little sharp edges. I don't think they'll ever eat grapefruit, but they do love kiwis. So I thought those might work and they're just so fun. So I got them some of those. All this will be linked. Uh, any of the food is linked in keto and this will be household. I'm going to show you this in a minute. I'm going to have it in travel. And then this I will have in beauty. Everybody always wants to know how my eyelashes are so long. This is it, y'all. This is my big secret revealed. I've been using this for maybe five years, honestly, maybe longer than that. One of my girlfriends um, that I used to do moms, um, moms of preschoolers mops um, with turned me on to this. Um, and now you can get it on Amazon, which is amazing. Uh, and they had like a lightning deal for Prime Day and it was $10 off. So I just got some because I keep it on hand because it's amazing. You just... Um, like take all your eye makeup off or whatever and then you put it on your lids um i always just do it like overnight and they just grow 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 and i love it so i got that and then um i did get a three pack of hockey cookies it was this one and like a brownie cookie and the snickerdoodle i already ate the other two at <laughs> the horse shows so i didn't bring this because i didn't want it to get melty so i'll have this one at some point but these are so good y'all i've had these before and they were great i just decided to get them because they were on the deal um then yeah, let me put let me do this part let me put this purse together and then we'll move on to some other things okay i tried to set this up so we get the full effect with the dress but look how cute this is gonna be uh, oh my goodness i mean this matches perfectly honestly i thought this was gonna be more khaki and it's not focused see here there we go that's better um but it like is this it's like almost a mustard color oh my gosh with the navy i think it's so stinking cute y'all oh my gosh so then I still can't figure out what earrings to do, but I'm thinking these kind of dusty blue ones. It kind of, I don't know. We'll figure out the earring later, but I'm so excited that the purse strap looks so cute with this. It's just like the perfect, like, little touristy outfit, right? Like, summer vacay. Anyway, these are the shoes, y'all. I think it's going to look cute with the little, um, kind of touch of sparkle at the bottom, but they're these Clarks. I told y'all about these. And even though it looks like I haven't tried them on, I have actually worn them around the house for a while and they are so stinking comfortable, y'all. I cannot even tell you like walking on clouds. Um, and all the reviews say like they wear them to work all day and this, that, and the other, and they never hurt their feet. So I'm so excited. So um, I will link these in beauty. They're kind of limited, especially this color, but there's other styles of this Clark wedge. Um, available they just didn't have my size and colors that i liked but some are like more like a strap across that actually i liked better than than um this style but they didn't have my size anyway there's if you just search like for clark wedges or go to the link that i have the other ones will pop up too probably they are so cute and so comfortable so these are the ones i picked out and i did put them pair them look at them with the blue dress that we tried on before from sheen and they're so cute with that too so these are gonna be like my vegas kind of casual can this be casual i don't know casual wedge you to just sort of wear around i love this i will bring um like my little uh my hair's already falling out um my little brown sinuk flip-flops that i wear the the leather flip-flops that i literally wear on repeat all summer like i will bring those with in case my feet start to hurt because i think a little brown flip-flop would be super cute with that outfit too um so i'll take those along like as a backup but i'm so excited for the little wedges i'll try them on um so that you can like see how they look on my feet or whatever but they're so comfortable and so cute so i was so excited about those those were not on any kind of deal or anything else and they're kind of pricey but like if they last and they're comfortable i'm here for it okay oh the travel bag let me show you that okay y'all it's hard to show you them but they're so stinking cute and i absolutely love them okay and this is the last thing i got and this was not um an amazon prime deal either but it was like 12 dollars i think 11.99 maybe and it is um a hanging um travel case i'm and not for makeup i have a separate one for makeup that's got flamingos on it that i got before we went to um was that san antonio i think last year anyway it's great but i i kept on going on these trips like to um we went to omaha obviously um and stayed in that hotel for a while and then um we went on our iowa trips and i kept on being like Ugh, i wish i could hang my my toiletry bag up i wish i could hang my toiletry bag up um it's just so much nicer and then it's not like taking up room on the sink and your stuff's everywhere and you're like digging for everything because this is what i have used for i don't know since merit was born for sure i have a lot of not a lot but like my um i have uh three of these that are like this print like in different sizes they're just like little you know zip up makeup bags and they're amazing like i love them and i have 
um, a jewelry tote, like a roll up jewelry thing that's really nice and big in this print too. And so I just love to use this because it all matches. Y'all know me, matchy matchy vacation um, or stuff. And I love this and I will still use this for like, I'll put something else in it, socks or you know, you can put anything in these little bags when you pack. But I want something that hangs up. And I used to have something, especially like when I lived in Montana and I would travel all the time for work and I would just always keep like a bag ready to go, um, a overnight bag, a toiletry bag, like everything was ready to go. And I had a hang up one, but anyway, whatever. For whatever reason, I've been using this one for like nine years or something, a long time. And I absolutely love it and will continue to use this because I love this print, but I wanted something that hung up. So I got this. I was looking at one that was actually on an Amazon Prime deal, but this one was cheaper and <laughs> I liked it better. So let me get it all open and I'll show you. I wish I would have gotten this sooner on all our other trips, but at least I'll have it now. And now things I can organize like my toothbrush, toothpaste and all that, and then have like the big um shampoos and all that kind of stuff down in here and it's got even more little organizing things in here and let's be honest y'all you know i loved it for the print i thought that was so fun <laughs> um and then it's got a little pouch here and then more organizing over here and then it's got a couple little zippered kind of net pouches here and then of course it hangs which is what i want so i can have this um just kind of like on the door where you know hotels always have little places to hang things so it'll just be out of the way and organized and i'm so excited and it's really not that much um like once it's all nice and folded down it's really not that much it's like the same size as the one I was already using, so that's not a problem. Um, and then my um, suitcase, you know, is like pink and flamingo, so I think this will look cute with it. So that is going to be my new toiletry bag, and I'm so excited. I cannot remember. Well, there's little pockets here, too. I can't remember if there were um, different patterns of this or not, but like I said, I linked it in travel so that if you want to check it out, you can. But I just thought this was so fun, and I'm so excited to have a hanging toiletry bag now so that things can be organized and um can be off of the sink so that is what i got i'm gonna put that with my vegas stuff because that will be my next trip y'all no my next trip is our um craig is waiting on me my <laughs> waiting patiently on me i still have my heels on um i or claw or not wedges my wedges uh my next trip is our little girls getaway with my girlfriends here um several of us have summer birthdays and we just kind of want to do a getaway so we're going to go to that um it's like a resort casino um that uh, craig and i went there last summer just as like a little kind of getaway for us but uh we're gonna go with the girls and sit by the pool all day and get a room and go out to eat and just have fun so that'll be my next trip and i will take that on that too so that way i can keep everything kind of out of the way and have my own little bag so that's good um so i'm excited about that trip i can't wait i'm gonna wear my wedges maybe and a cute little outfit for dinner that'll be fun maybe one of my dresses i don't know i don't really want to wear anything until vegas <laughs> <laughs> we'll see what I wear. Anyway, we're going to go to Jimmy John's and run Craig's errands, and then I'll check back up soon. Did I just say check back up? Check back in. <laughs> Jimmy John's. It has been a hot minute since we got to go on a little day date. We have had Jimmy. When did we have Jimmy John's last? Oh, on vacation on the last day. I was like, we had this recently. Anyway, y'all know what I get. Beach Club Unwitch and a Diet Coke. I just fell down. <laughs> Never mind everybody else. <laughs> Real life. Part of the errands was checking this field out here. What do y'all think it looks like? I'm on the phone with my daddy. Hang on, daddy. I'm recording. <laughs> What'd you think? Huh? What'd you think? It's all right. Looks all right. Is this one ours too? No. Just this one. That's <laughs> bears. Okay. <laughs> super far away over here. I have delivered stuff to you in this field, so I did know this one existed. <laughs> Aren't you proud of me? Uh, yeah. Oh, we're going to check another one? Yeah. I'm excited. <laughs> so this field we're checking now, if you're a real OG follower and used to read when I vlogged, we Blog. always called, vlogged, B-L-O-G, we used to always call this one the baby because this was the first field that we rented like together after we were like married. Oh, there's a feather. Um, and we didn't have any children and Craig was like obsessed with this field. He'd come out here all the time. And so I called it the baby because it was our child. <laughs> anyway, it looks good. Looks good. I want to see that pheasant. Did it go? It's a robot dairy. Robot dairy. Robots from the house. How can you just tell? Right, because I talked to the guy. Oh, well you can't tell. Can we no. go in there? Dairy tour. <laughs> it's not our 
cars. No, we're not going in there. Anyway, I wanted to show them that pheasant. Did it fly off? Yeah. Anyway, it's raining, y'all. I don't know where you're at, but Whoa. in Northwest Iowa, we were in a drought. And so any amount of rain or moisture, we get excited about. So I know I was fussing about that raining all day at that horse show, but it was like a blessing in disguise. All right, we're going to check the other ones too. Yeah. He ropes me into things. He bribes me with food and then we had to drive around all day checking people. <laughs> well, this will be knee high by the 4th of July. And he's really tall, so it's really more than regular knee height. <laughs> 4th of July is Saturday. And this is Monday. No, 4th of July is Sunday. Is the 4th on... Whoa! Sorry about that. Is the 4th on Sunday? I think it is. Um... There's a saying that it's like knee high by the 4th of July. Your corn's going to be okay if it's knee high by the 4th of July. Anyway. Um, oh my gosh, he's really tall as he gets out there. I mean, how far is he going to go out there? What exactly is he checking? <laughs> oh my goodness. Looks good to me. Alright, last one y'all. This is about a house. This is that wheat he cut. The other day and the bales and then he replanted um, forage sorghum back into it is that right if that's right i deserve some brownie points <laughs> few questions was that wheat to begin with yes one point what did you plant after you cut the wheat i don't know what did i plant after i cut the wheat I already told him, I want you to tell me see if I got it right. I'm gonna hear you say it. I don't believe you. Just tell me. No, you Forage sorghum. You got it. Ding, 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 ding. Five points. I'm giving myself five points. <laughs> Woohoo! Praise the Lord for this rain. I'm going to pick up the boys. There's my buddies. They are so tired. <laughs> they can't even hardly hold their eyes open, but they had so much fun. Did you love it? And we went to this place called the. Um, <laughs> saddle up. The, you, you saw uh, the horses? The saddle up. They went swimming and, and seven, they had a hike. And there were seven horses and there was like five or four um wagons like from the Oregon Trail. And it was so awesome. And then they, they had their like bunk beds and their own freezer. Oh my gosh, stuff. are you going to do saddle up camp one day? Yeah, they had a little. Oh my gosh, how They fun. had a tiny place where they eat. I also saw Merritt that they do wilderness camp there too, where you sleep outside in teepees. Oh my goodness, maybe next year. Yeah. <laughs> All right, they have a team name and a song that Coy just told me Merritt's not going to do it. But Coy's he's going to do it for us. It's, um. Y'all are called the what? The chocolate chips and um, on Sean goes like chocolate chips, chocolate chips, chocolate chip, chocolate chip, ch chocolate chips. They're tasty and they're yummy. We like them and they're tummy. <laughs> they're cool but not as sunny. We are the chocolate chip, chocolate chips. Woo! I love it. It's oh, from and the Adams family. It is from the Adams family. And um, we sang it in the lunchroom. Oh my gosh. No, I want to go to summer camp. <laughs> Their shirts are so cute this year. Their theme is Be Renewed. I love this pretty maroon and yellow. All right, y'all. It's a feast. We're having all the leftovers from last night. I had steak last night, so I wanted to have a burger tonight. I've got avocado and um, lettuce and cheese. I've got a little, fr um, not fruit, vegetable and ranch. And then cookies that you didn't give to Clay. I tried to give Clay, Catherine's husband, all of these, um, cheesecake cookies because this is like famous around here this bakery and these cookies are amazing and they're Craig's favorite and he was I was trying to give them all to Clay and Craig's like whoa 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 wait a minute wait a minute <laughs> anyway they're delicious um veggies and ranch and then some of my hello um chips I cannot think of anything y'all I'm tired um chips to go with it and that is going to be supper okay y'all i think i am just going to go ahead and end this one here we i don't know if i told y'all this or not but we got espn or whatever the heck it is we got sling and then you got espn it was like ten dollars for the month so we have been watching all the games rooting mississippi state on even i am like into it surprisingly so that game is tonight my mama sent him this big box um what'd you say I know, right? It's so weird. I'm like obsessed with it. Anyway, um, Mama sent the boys this box with like Mississippi State hats and shirts and all the things. So they've been so excited. They've been wearing their hats everywhere. Um, 
So we're gonna watch the game tonight. Um, I need to kind of regroup and repack backpacks with fresh towels and swimsuits and all that to go um, tomorrow. And I forgot their goggles. That's the first thing they said when they got in the car. Mom, you didn't pack our goggles. I was like, sorry. <laughs> anyway. I'm gonna redo all that um, and get going for tomorrow, but I am going to bring you along tomorrow. Like I said, I've got to take clothes to the cleaners. I need to go to that farm store to try to find the things. Um, the show she, it's called Peppy. If you're horse people, maybe you know what Peppy is. Uh, I don't know what if it's like a COVID thing or what, but you could not get it anywhere. So I'm gonna go try to find that and then run to my favorite stores, of course, and then be back in time to pick the boys up um, from camp. And then they have haircuts at 5.30. So I'll take you along for all the fun. But for now, make sure you subscribe to my channel so you don't miss a thing and we will see you in the next one. Bye y'all.